I'm Merlin, I'm a local artist, an up and coming artist and we're in Stokes Croft. I have a gallery which I'm going to take you into now and show you my artwork, if you'd like to follow me. It's called the Emporium Gallery, number 37 Stokes Croft. Welcome to Croft Circle Country. I'm the local artist that's documenting all the major formations that have appeared in Crop Circle Country in Wiltshire in England. And the visitors and tourists come from all over the world to see these formations. Why I, I paint the formations is because, like I say, they have to be recorded because they're very significant. It's, it's such a strange mystery to me that it's affected my whole life because of an investigation called Operation Blackbird, which was a very famous operation in 1990 where Colin Andrews, who investigated these formations in the early days, set up a Nippon TV, German TV, American networks, all set this equipment on this field and he said nothing can get in the field and nothing can get out of the field without us knowing. This was never planned for me to go into this field. At the time I was a removal man. There was nothing on board except the board game, discs, and my staff, and a few personal things. I don't know what made me go there, and I don't know what guided me to that field, but I was there. There was no formation in the field when I arrived. When I arrived in the field, something really freaky happened. All the technology was zoomed in on this field, and there was a formation that appeared whilst I was in the field. It was formed, it, this sounds really, really far out, it was formed by a big black wobbly mass of energy. It did really disturb me, but it didn't sink in until afterwards. This has taken me 20 years to invent, which is the crop circle board game. It's all based on Stonehenge and the mystical experience of building Stonehenge with the zodiac signs, druids, aliens, UFOs, you name it. This is what it's all about and how to explain it. Colin said to me, yes, but you made the game after Operation Blackbird. And I've said no, many, many years before. Now you don't just produce a game, boom, and there it is. I'll just quickly show you the crop circle cards, which are based from the painting. All the formations are on the cards, earth, fire, water, air, twilight cards. And every time you pick a crop circle card up, going around the board, you follow the instructions. And it has to work with 12 zodiac signs. Each person sits behind their birth sign and plays. They all interact together. And they all go on this mystical journey through the ley lines. All leading to Stonehenge. They all build the stones. They all put it up. And the winner places the altar stone in the centre. I'm a very serious artist. I take it very serious. It's my life. It's my passion. And you'll be seeing more of Merlin paintings, more of Merlinism, more of crop circles. Uh, they're going to get bigger and bigger and bigger.